Karthik is the best, the purest and most glorious of all the months. Karthik month is particularly dear to Lord Sri Krishna. In the month of Kartika, one should daily offer a ghee lamp to Sri Krishna and daily recite the prayer known as Damodarashtakam. The link to the Damodarashtakam prayer as well as Damodara booklet containing the details of Kartika month is given in the description from where you can download it and enjoy the maximum benefit of the Kartika month. Now I will tell you the Damodara Leela of Lord Sri Krishna. Once when Mother Yashoda was feeding her lovely son Krishna, she noticed that the milk on the stove was overflowing. So she put Krishna down and went to attend to this. Left alone by his mother, Krishna became very angry and broke the pot of butter, kept there for churning. He took the butter out of it and with false tears in his eyes, he began to eat the butter in a secluded place. Mother Yashoda searched for Krishna all over the place. She found her son sitting on a big wooden grinding mortar, kept upside down. On seeing his mother with a stick in her hand, Krishna got down from the grinding mortar and began to flee in fear. Mother Yashoda chased him to all corners trying to capture the Supreme Personality of Godhead, who is never approached even by the meditation of great yogis. The Supreme Lord was playing just like a little child for such a great devotee as Mother Yashoda. Finally, Mother Yashoda caught Krishna. Krishna was almost on the point of crying. His eyes became restless from fear. Seeing that her son was fearful, Mother Yashoda threw away the stick. To punish him, she thought to bind him with ropes. She did not know that it is actually impossible for her to bind the Supreme Lord. When she tried to bind him, she always found that the rope was short by two inches. She gathered more ropes from the house and joined them, but still she found the same shortage. In attempting to bind her son, she became tired. Then Lord Krishna appreciated the hard labor of his mother and being compassionate upon her, he agreed to be bound up by the ropes. Krishna, playing as a human child in the house of Mother Yashoda, was performing his own settled pastimes. Of course, no one can control the Supreme Personality of Godhead, but he agrees to be controlled by his pure devotees. This incident of Krishna's breaking the pot of yogurt and being bound by Mother Yashoda took place on the Diwali day. This pastime is elaborately described in the ninth chapter of the 10th canto of Srimad Bhagavatam. To download the Damodarashtakam prayer from the link given in the description and stay connected to our channel for more such videos. Thank you.